Hello, I'm Tesla, and in this one, we're going to build upon the basic pickup tutorial by adding a super jump power up to our pickup. So let's jump in. Okay, so with our basic pickup, we're going to come into the blueprint, we're going to come to the graph, and take out Destroy Actor. We're going to grab the static mesh and the collision. We're going to drag these out and type in Destroy Component. And we're going to drag this one out and type in Destroy Component as well. Connect these up. Now the reason for this is we want to add some functionality after it disappears. If we use destroy actor, it's just going to destroy the whole blueprint and that's not what we want. So let's drag this out and type in print string. Just to tell us that our super jump has activated. So we're going to right click, type in get player character. Drag this out, get character movement. And then set jump speed jump Z velocity sorry so to find out your jump Z velocity is basically a value of how high you can jump we'll come to the character blueprint and then the defaults we can type in the search bar jump Z and we have jump Z velocity so it's set to 600 so let's say we double it to 1200 and then delay for five seconds and then we can copy this and then send it back to 600. So basically we, basically we can jump at this value for 5 seconds and then it goes back to normal. And we can connect the target up to the character movement. And then we can just use a print string again and type in super jump deactivated. And that's all we need to do. So now we can use our super jump for 5 seconds and it's deactivated now. So that's it for this tutorial. It's just been a really quick look at how to set up a super jump power up. Thanks for checking it out and make sure you stay subscribed for my future tutorials. Cheers guys.